guys, it's me. Oh, sorry. Hey guys, it's Amanda. So, um, I'm gonna be doing a review on the. Oh, so I'll take a look. The KQC um, Professional Ceramic X Heat Straightener. Um, so this is from FlatironExperts.com. They did send this to me for reviewing purposes, um, but I'm being completely honest with my opinion on it and stuff. But yeah, so um, it has ceramic plates, which is like better for your hair. Um, and so they're, I'm just gonna like get into it already. But this, it's like, if you see the shape of it, it like kind of dips down right here. So it like ma really makes these like get close together, but it's not like so close that your hair gets like stuck in it, you know? Um, I had a Chi before, but my sister took it to college when she went to college. And that one used to always get like stuck in my hair. And also like it, concave like it went down like right here and that one like it made it kind of hurt when you had to squeeze it because you had to squeeze it kind of hard um but yeah this one's really good and it gets hot on the outside too um so you can curl your hair with it if you want me to do a video on like things that you could do with straightener like how you can curl your hair with straightener how you can wave it um and all that fun stuff then let me know and i will um and yeah it, this actually really makes my hair like shiny um, like, and it makes it soft too. My hair is never this, like, soft and smooth and stuff. Um, but it is when I use this. I don't know what makes it, like, so shiny and soft, but it does. And, um, it gets up to whatever temperature you would like. With the Chi that I had, you only had one heat setting, which is not a good choice for people because, um, some people have thinner hair and they can't use that heat, like, that high of a heat. Um, this one ranges from... 140 to 410 if you can see this right here um yeah so it's from that's 410 and this is 140 um my hair i have like thick hair um maybe it doesn't seem like it on camera but i really do and um i have to put mine on the 410 because it is like makes it way easier to straighten with my hair but um, if you don't have that thick of hair and it's easier for you to straighten your hair, then don't use it on 4 or 10 because you will burn your hair. Um, so depending on your hair type, that means like what temperature you can go to. Um, if you have really fine hair, then that's when you go to like the 140 or a little bit higher. Um, and then if you have thick hair, then 410. Um, it does get like hot, like you could see steam coming up. Like when you go through your hair, you could see steam coming off of it. But, and that's what I was afraid about. I was afraid that it was gonna like burn my hair. But my hair has not been burned um, at all from using it. Not even my ends. My ends still look so healthy. Like, I don't even know how it looks that healthy. Like, it looks like, you know, when you get your hair cut, it's like all fresh and stuff. Um, but yeah, so my hair is like a lot healthier because I don't normally straighten it that much because I have naturally straight hair. But um, I take a shower before I go to bed now, now that it's like um, back to school. So when I wake up in the morning, my hair is like really wavy since I sleep on it wet. So this is, I have to straighten my hair in the morning. And yeah, so this is a KQC. It is more expensive than the Chi that I was talking about, but I think it's way worth it um, because there's so many more per perks to it. So I just really like this. this is the best flat iron I've ever, ever had, no doubt. Um, and yeah, so you just has this long swivel cord so you can go like longer with it. And like right here it twists so it kind of moves with you. And then you just like clamp it like that, really easy to close the on and off button. And yeah, these um, plates, they these ones don't move around like the Chi one does. So I think that's probably why it doesn't like get stuck on your hair. But, yeah, and then it comes with it, like, no, it doesn't come with this, sorry, you have to buy this, but they sent it to me, this, um, holder for it, you just, like, it has these little suction cups, and you stick it to your desk or something, um, I have it at my desk, it sticks really, really good to, like, a countertop in your bathroom, but I use this in my room sometimes, so, and it doesn't really stick that well to my desk, but it still works, like, wonders, because I always just, like, set this down on something, and then it will burn it, or it'll get really hot, or also um, when I use my curling iron, I set in weird places and I end up burning myself a lot because I know I got I have like two scars on my legs because I would like curl my hair and I didn't want to have to set it down, you know, whatever. So I'd like hold my curling iron while I was trying to grab another piece of hair and that's how I burnt myself. 
Um, but this is this really works well for both of those. I use it with my curling iron. You could tell like um, since it, there's a hole in the back, so it like goes through it to the other end, and I don't think it's meant to be right there or something because it like burnt it. It's like you could see it got melted and then it dried. But I mean, I don't really have a problem with that. But I would think that maybe since it's like meant for hot stuff, it would, you know. But inside here is completely fine, you know. Um, and they have like holes on the top so it doesn't get too hot in there. So this is a lifesaver and it's awesome. And also, this KQC Thermal Shine Heat Protectant, like it's by the same brand. This isn't in focus, so I'm so sorry. Um, this is. This, I don't know if it's just the straightener, but this, I think this combo together makes my hair so sleek and shiny. This is for a silky smooth shine and heat protection, so I'm guessing this probably does add to how, like, shiny and um, smooth my hair has been. But this stuff is the best heat protectant ever. If you watched my videos from a long time ago, you'd, like, know that I love this. I had this a long time ago. I ran out of it, and... Um, you have to buy it online. I just never got around to buying it online. I just got the Trust Me one. But this is like, it's like a fine mist. It's not like squirting your hair like a lot of heat protectant, a lot of heat protectants are. Um, and this also, it smells like boy. Um, it smells like cologne or stuff. But I don't know. Maybe you won't like that. But me personally, I love it so much. I just want to show you this candle that I got. And it smells like Abercrombie. Like, these kind of have, like, the same kind of scents. This is mahogany teak wood from Bath & Body Works. And it smells, like, alike. And I don't know why. I've just been obsessed with the these scents. Sometimes I just spray this on my hair for, one, to make it, like, shiny and stuff. And then, two, because it smells so good. Um, but, yeah, that was my review on it. I hope you guys enjoyed. The link will be down below. And all the other stuff... Um, it will link you to the specific products also. And then um, I will put a clip here of me straightening my hair, showing you how I use it and stuff. So yeah, um, I hope you guys enjoy this and thanks for watching. Bye. Okay, so I just turned on my straightener. And yeah, and then I spray some heat protectant all over my hair. Um, this is a KQC Thermal Shine one that obviously I talked about in the video. Then I just brush my hair through to get all the knots out and to distribute the product evenly. And then I part my hair too. And, okay, I'm still waiting. Now I start shading my hair. I don't do anything special because my hair isn't, like, curly or anything. So I just go over it. I don't, like, section it off. Um, I just kind of go through the pieces I think need to be straightened. And... I do it on one side and then I do it to the other side. And also with my bangs, I don't like when oh, there's my friend Taylor. Um she comes over in the morning, so um but <laughs> Okay, um with my bangs, I don't ever straighten them. I don't like them when they're stuck to my face. Um I either just leave them natural or I like curl them a little bit like how I'm showing you in this video. I don't like them stick straight to my face, but that's how that's like my preference. Um but yeah, that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed, and thanks for watching. Bye! Mwah.